you got your workout clothes on and you're ready to rock and you head out to your garage and then nothing really happens. Is this happening to you? Is your at-home workouts really just not cutting it? Well, here are three tips to slay your next workout. So you came here cause you wanna be a star. Hi guys, I'm Sean LaFlock, founder of Flock Fitness. And if you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button below. So tip number one is block out the time for your workout. This is so, so important. Distractions are very, very easy ways of getting yourself out of your workout. So what you wanna do is block out the time in your schedule, 45 minutes, half hour, whatever you got. It doesn't have to be crazy. You don't have to have a workout for three hours. What you wanna do is hold yourself accountable to that time. The other thing that you can do is shut your phone off during that time if you can. Obviously, if you're an emergency worker or you have something important, you can leave your phone on, but if you turn your phone off, you're not gonna have that constant distraction next to you. So tell your friends that you're working out, your family that you're working out, shut off your phone and then get after it. Tip number two, improving your at-home workout is write it down. I know this sounds silly, but when you write your workout down, it kind of takes away the options for you. So options are actually something that makes it harder for you to do stuff because if you have options, it means you could do something else and now your brain is working harder for you to figure out what the proper option is. If you write everything down that you wanna do in your workout, you have one option, do your workout. So make sure you're taking the time to write it down and then execute. My final tip to improving your at-home workouts, invest in equipment. This is, a, this is a touchy one, especially nowadays, since it's hard for you to maybe find equipment, but you need like two or three solid pieces of equipment in order for you to have enough variety in your workouts. Now, you don't actually have to go to the store. You can go on eBay, you can go on Craigslist. You can, I mean, if you wanna venture through Craigslist, you can go on Let It Go or any of those Facebook marketplaces. And you can find some great used equipment that people are just like, let, like letting collect dust in their house or in their garage. And you can utilize those pieces of equipment in your at-home workouts. I would say at a minimum, you need a set of dumbbells, a jump rope, and maybe some like basic exercise bands that you can put around your thighs or something like that. With those types of pieces of equipment, you can do almost an infinite amount of workouts and that will allow you to have more variety. Variety equals fun. And when you're having more fun in your workouts, you're gonna be much more likely to complete them. Do you have any other questions or did you learn something from this video? Leave it below in the comments. And if you need personal training, training programs, or nutrition coaching, reach us at flockfitness.com. If you learned anything or you like this video, make sure you like, subscribe, share it with your friends, and I'll see you next time for another episode of Flock Fitness. Take care, guys.